Hello everyone. So in this particular video, we are going to see about filter transformation in a PySpark. Filter transformation is similar to in SQL, we have a where condition, right? In a where condition, we write a certain condition and, and based on that, we try to filter a data. In a PySpark, we have a filter transformation. Let me show you with the example. Suppose we have one of the data frame, we are reading this order.parquet file. Uh, this particular file actually we are reading. And suppose from this particular uh, data, you only want to see uh, where country is India. So in this case, what actually you can use? You can use a filter transformation and you can only filter a country data. Suppose your requirement is like you want to see where the payment method is debit card. You want to filter only those data. Then what actually you can use? You can use a, a filter transformation. Let's take an example. So for that, what you have to write? First, you have to write a, a DF. Uh, first, you have to write a DF. This is our data frame, right? Now, after that, we want to filter. The DF dot filter you have to write, right? And what actually you want to filter? DF dot payment method. I want to filter DF dot payment method equal equal to the DF dot payment method. It should be equal to the debit card. Debit card. Card. DF dot payment method equal to the a debit card so from data frame we are filtering the payment method equal to the debit card now if you want to see your data so what i have to write display and if i will show you if i'll execute this now with what will happen in this particular data frame only if the payment method is debit card that only data you will see now you can see all the payment method is equal to the a debit card we can see that now suppose your requirement is like you want to see where the payment method is debit card and also the status is completed. So that data actually you want to see. So in this case, what actually we can do? We have to use a filter only. What we will use? DF dot filter. I want to see where uh, DF dot payment method. Payment method it should be equal to the debit card. Payment method should be equal to the debit card. But I also want to see I also want to see where the status should be completed. So what I have to write DF dot payment method equal to the debit card. You can write into a one bracket like this. And after that, you can write one condition and and the status should be complete also. Right. So what I will write DF dot status equal equal to the it should be completed. Completed. So this is what actually I want. So like this, we have to mention close a bracket. And now if you want to see a data, what you have to write display. And let's see the result. Now in this case, what will happen? We are using an and condition. So oh, what is the issue? Let's try to understand your DF dot method equal equal to the debit card. Let me execute again. Now in this case, what will happen? It will show me only those data where the payment method is debit card and also the status is completed. So and condition means both the conditions should be satisfied means this condition also should be satisfied and this condition also should be satisfied. Now suppose your requirement is like either the payment method should be a debit card or the status should be completed that actually you want to see. So in this case what actually you can write. So what we will write. Instead of AND condition, we will write a OR condition. So for OR condition, what you have to uh, mention like this, this is a particular symbol we have to mention for the OR condition. Now if I will execute, in this case what will happen, either one of the condition is satisfying, right? You will see the result. So you can see either the debit card, either the payment method is debit card or the status is completed. You can see debit payment method is debit card, but the status is not completed. Then also I can see the date. You can see the status is completed, but the payment method is not debit card. Means either the payment method should be a debit card or the status should be completed. You will see all those records. But in the case of the AND condition, both the condition it will satisfy then only only you will see the result. So like this actually you can do. Now suppose your requirement is like you want to see a data. Uh, you want to see a data where payment method payment method ends with a D. You want to see a data where payment method ends with a D. Then how actually you can write that? 
I want to see df dot filter. I want to see only those record where the payment method df dot payment method ends with ends with uh, let's use a card card. If the payment method ends with card, this will only show me those record. Now, if you want to see a data display, if you have to write like this, in this case, what will happen? If the payment method is ending with the card, it will show you only those record. So you can see debit card, it is showing all the record which is ending with the card, it will show you the result. You can see credit card also coming. If it is ending with the card, it will show you the result. Now suppose your requirement is like you want to see a data where the payment method is start with a C. So what you have to write df dot payment method starts with you want to see where if the payment method which is start with a C only those record you want to see. So like this you have to mention df dot payment method dot it starts with C. Now in this case what will happen if the payment method if the starting letter is C right then only you can see all the record and the check is coming credit card is coming cash is coming so all the things which is starting with that particular letter right uh, that actually we can filter so this starts with an end with to find to do a data analysis uh, for finding for the data cleaning this kind of the operation these are the useful now suppose my requirement is like I want to see a data where country contains IND. So if anywhere in the country column IND is present, I want to see those record. Either in starting, either in end. If it contains IND, I want to see the record. So in this case, what you have to mention. So we will write df dot filter df dot country dot like if it contains anywhere IND, right? That data I want to see and uh, if you want to see the record display we have to write so we want anywhere it should contain the IND right so what you have to write percentage percentage so df dot filter df dot country dot like percent percent IND if you will do right if anywhere IND contain in the country column you will see the record let's see what are the records we have where the country contain IND you can see few places India is coming, few places IND is coming, all those records which contain IND, right? I can see all those records with the help of this method. So like this actually we can filter our data. So with the help of the filter, you can apply any kind of the condition and based on that your data will be filtered. So please do practice.